Hi, hello everyone. Magandang hapon po sa inyo lahat. At tunaw naman po si Richard Solomon of my YouTube channel Cha and My Narratives, The Stroke Survivor. It's a great day po para sa ating mga Pilipino dahil uh, despite na nasa pandemic po tayo, still in COVID crisis, meron na naman po isang napakagandang balita para po sa ating Pilip lahat ng mga Pilipino. That's something that we can be proud of as Pinoy's, no? At ito po ay ang emergence ng bagong magiging bagong uh, sports heroine, kumbaga sa larangan ng sports. At guess what? Po anong larangan ng anong sports po ito? Uh, ito po ay golf, no? Na kung saan ang mga Pilipino po ay uh, hindi pa po naka-achieve ng isang world champion but for the first time in the history of Philippine golf golf po no ay meron na tayong matatawag na world caliber caliber um, athlete or world caliber go, golfer at ito po ang marami at ito po yung medyo na uh, kamangha-mangha unang-una po hindi po siya lalaki Pangalawa po, alam po natin na kapag larong golf, usually ito yung tinatawag na uh, old men's sports. Eh, no? Larong na ng mga matatanda na, 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 na lalaki. At, uh, pero po ito po ay nabago ang pananaw ng mga tao so, sa golf, no? sa buong mundo. Noong naging champion po sa kauna-unang pagkakataon ng isang sa, sa pinakamasikat at icon, world icon athlete na si Tiger Woods no? sa murang edad na bata. Doon na break yung monotony ng golf na ito ay para sa mga matatanda lamang. No? So, starting with, of course, with the Tiger Woods uh, the ta tiger, tiger, tiger Woods phenomena actually has sparked a lot of golf enthusiasts not only sa mga matatanda lalo na sa mga bata kaya marami na nagsusulputan ng mga galing sa golf ngayon sa Japan marami no? Korean Koreans mga pababae mga palalaki pero ito pong bagandang balita po na ito ngayon ay para naman po sa ating mga Pilipino and uh, yeah, mamaya po play po natin yung last uh, play of Uh, sudden uh, game po ni uh, uh, ni Yuka Sa Saso siya, ba, uh, isa po siyang Pilip Pilipina babae in fact dalaga, dalaga po dalagita pa nga ata no? kasi siya lang po ay siya po ay 19 years old pa lang in fact she is now considered one of the youngest or if not the youngest Uh, female to ever win the US Women's PGA Golf Women's Championship no the 76 US Women Women's uh, Golf Championship sa America po no so pero si uh, si Saso po si Yuka Saso ay actually hindi po talagang ngayon lang nag-goal po yan no? in fact in 2018 she already won two gold medals in the 2018 Asian Games sa Asia pa lang Asian Games now actually she, I think she is now entitled to the Olympics in Japan no? itong uh, darating na Olympics po sa Japan no? so panoorin po natin ang laro po ni Yaya Saso uh, siya po ay actually uh, half Filipino and half Japanese dahil ang mother niya po ay Pilip Filipina pero ang tatay niya po ay Hapon no? so siguro kiniklaim rin siya ngayon ng, although she's representing of course Philippines siguro natutuwa rin ng mga Hapon ngayon dahil kasi because she is half Filip Filipino and half Japanese so gusto ko po kayong dalhin dun sa laro na ito po ay na uh, aggregate playoff na po sila at ito po yung huling hole no the 19th hole kung paano niya po nasungkit yung pinaka isa sa pinakamalaking uh, 
golfing event sa US Women's PGA you know uh, in fact ito ay nagka, nanalo po siya ng premium 1 million US dollars or equivalent sa pesos ng mga 48 million plus wow and meron na naman po tayong like I said Pinay Heroin in Sports which is ang kaka mga mga po ay sa golf pa okay panoorin po natin ito Advantage Yukasasa Massive opportunity here to potentially break through and win and everything that comes with that obviously a USGA championship but also the opportunity to become a member of the LPGA Tour and to play on the biggest women's tour full time she's not a member yet and this is a huge moment for her 19 years of age model her golf swing on Rory Bakor yeah po naglalakad ay si Yaya Sasso Rory swing and uh Yuka Sasso the master she spent an hour just studying his golf swing videos online and Rory sending out a message uh, recognizing that on social media this weekend she hopes to meet Rory later this summer at yan naman po yung kalaban niya na nakapula si Nasa Tanawoka ng Japan siya po yung kalaban ni Yuka Sasso sa playoff top players Yes, you always think you might have the tempo of Fred Couples or the swing of Rory McIlroy, so young use the rhythm, but doesn't quite work out like that. First to tee off is uh, Panawaka. She and Greg really work well together. She relies on him for his input, but ultimately she sees it, feels it, executes it. But he was reminding her that they had a similar putt on a similar line earlier today, one that she made for Birdie, although this probably almost doubled the distance away. Yeah, we saw that putt a little earlier, okay? It's almost the exact same putt that Yuka Sasso had in uh, the first playoff hole. Uphill at the early stage of this putt? Yeah, uphill the entire way and it moves right to left, starts moving more right to left as it gets closer to the hole. Low percentage chance of making this. I think she's got to ensure that she gets it up close force your opponent to do something. Just gonna run out of speed. You would think it will be a four major championship pressure as uh, strange things to people's games. As we saw from Lexi Thompson on the way in. You're just joining us. This is the playoff for the 76th U.S. Women's Open. Yuka Sasso against Nasa Hataoka. Lexi Thompson had a putt on the 18th to get into the playoff. Did not make it. This is actually their second swing on a three-par. I think this is a three-par goal on the 19th. Yeah, it's her third chance with putt to win. The same line she had earlier with short putt. She had put it the first time. Turns left and not a ton. Yeah, the fact that she's had a, a similar putt, Jerry, she knows exactly what this is going to do. Great opportunity here for Yuka Sasso. Yes! Sasso is the U.S. Women's Open champion, a new star in the women's game. Jan po na nalo si Yuka Sasso. Preparing to win, doing it in style. How about that, Morgan? Tinalo niya po ang mas experienced na si Tanawaka. At ngayon magiging member na rin po siya ng U.S. LPGA Tour. Top star, two 
doubles early. I mean, perseverance was key. And that was a great stroke. Definitely learned playing it in the first playoff hole. Ajan na po. Nagtatapos, no? This yung uh, yung uh, pal yung video po ng uh, pinakita ko na po sa inyo yung last uh, hole or the 19th hole of of the uh, playoffs uh, and they play on a on a aggregates two hole aggregate sudden death no at uh, before coming to the playoffs nga eh uh, alanganin pa siya makapasok dahil siya ay 5 uh, strokes behind no and lagi siyang napupunta sa rough pero do eh, ako parang yun yung strength niya no na, nakakalusot nakaka, na naaaho niya palagi yung sarili niya no halos hindi siya nagfe fairway pero yun ang parang nakita nila ngayon sa sa laro na to ni Yuka Sasso na ma kaya niyang ibangon yung sarili niya sa, pa sa pagkakalagay niya sa rough at uh, dun sa mas uh, uh, nanalo uh, or uh, tumiba pagdating sa sa green no and ang sa golf po kasi ang pinaka importante yung do sa green eh kung paano ka magpat no magpat no magpagulong ng bola para may shoot mo dun sa of course sa hole no sa ngayon ah uh, dahil po diyan sa panalong yan nalalagay na naman po sa mapa ang Pilipinas <laughs> sa ka kaibahang uh, sports na natatakuli kay Bea marami po tayong magagaling na uh, golfer no mula noon pero hindi lang po nananalo ng mga world events world uh, golfing events katulad niyan and that is a, one of the most prestigious and one of the most um, uh, prized uh, ito, uh, it has a huge prize money of 1 million US dollar imagine so and that of course uh, will put Yuka Sasso uh, of the Philippines uh, mabibigyan po siya ng magandang a leap, a huge leap in the rankings no? and of course she would have a, I think she will now have an automatic birth or um, spot in the Olympics, Tokyo Olympics and other than that she will now be invited to a lot of uh, she would have an automatic uh, qualification and invitation to a lot of US LPGA tours no so again congratulations sa ating bagong uh, golfing sensation at the age of only 19 years old kay Yuka Sasso and we have uh, uh, sa gitna ng pandemic at sa covid no merong isang uh, bright uh, future ahead of uh, Filipinos now in in golf and this would of course affect a lot of uh, Filipino golfers uh, all over the world and a lot of youth not only uh, a lot of uh, young ones not only in the for in the Philippines gaya po na ef effect po or influence or inspiration na ginawa na nangyari nung na ginawa ni Tiger Woods and even just like nung na, uh, naglaro si Michael Jordan sa Spain sa Barcelona Olympics noon na naka-inspire ng maraming uh, players around the world young players so with that uh, again another uh, heroine Filipino Filipino Pinoy pride or Pinoy pride uh, for all of us in the person of Miss Yuka Sasso okay bye for now this is just uh, my reaction to the win uh, it's also it's a celebration for all of us Filipinos something to look forward into and hope uh, for a better Philippines to come and for Filipinos too okay with that again this is Richard Solomon of my youtube channel saying please 
God bless and love one another more so your families. Ingat po kayo palagi. Bye-bye for now.